All right, so this is going to be some dosage problems using the Davidson pie chart. Uh, as a preface, I claim no ownership to any of the questions or material presented in this video. It's everything I have gotten I've sourced off the open internet. Uh, in the following slides, I will answer the questions using the formulas to the best of my knowledge. Um, I'm doing this to help me study. You know, making this PowerPoint is helping me. Hopefully it helps you. Let's get on with the slides. All right, so this is the Davidson pie chart. This is taken from page three of the state of Florida drinking water exam formula sheet that they give you. I don't know if the state that you're in does the same. This is the sheet the state of Florida gives it's on page three of eight. Using the Davidson pie chart to solve dosage questions, it's actually pretty simple. Um, you get the pie set up into little different wedges. You'll take your given stuff out of your formulas, your knowns and your unknowns, uh, which will be your pounds a day of feed, your flow a million gallons a day or your dosage 8.34 is a constant as we can read here using the Davidson pie chart find the quantity above the horizontal line multiply the three pie wedges below these together and next you'll divide by the percent purity of the decimal if it is not 100 percent purity uh, to solve for one of the pie wedges below the horizontal line, you will divide the two bottom pie wedges into the quantity of pounds above the horizontal line, and again, multiply by the percent purity of the decimal, you know, 65%, 0.65. Uh, the given units must match the units shown in the pie wheel. You see, we are in pounds per gallon, milligrams per liter, milligrams per liter, equal to parts per million. Flow must be in million gallons a day and the pounds of feed a day or the pounds. Again, the purity, once you solve for the equation in the pie charts, then you would multiply as a decimal. Again, just to clarify, you're solving for a quantity above the horizontal line above the horizontal line that would be pounds per day 100 percent purity and it's not 100 percent pure it's above the horizontal line you're going to divide percent purity as a decimal so 65 cent percent would be 0.65 you're dividing if you're solving for above the horizontal line And if you are solving for one of the pie wedges below the horizontal line, my horrible highlighter here, you will multiply percent purity to that. Solving for below, so if it was below a million gallons a day, the dose, you would multiply above the line, divide, below the line, multiply. All right, so the first question, if the desired dose for chlorine is two milligrams per liter, how many pounds of chlorine per day will be needed to treat 2.1 million gallons per day? All right, here is the Davidson pie chart we'll be using to solve this problem. First step that I like to go through is your knowns and your unknowns. All right, so what the question gives us or knowns is your desired dose, 2.0 milligrams per liter. And it also gives you the flow, 2.1 million gallons per day. And the unknown is going to be the pounds per day needed to get this desired dose. So because we are able to fill out the bottom with the things we know, the 2.1 million gallons a day times the dose 
times the standard of 8.34. That's going to give us our answer. So the feed rate pounds per day is equal to dosage milligrams per liter times the flow of million gallons per day times the standard of 8.34 pounds per gallon. Here are values plugged into our math formula. That's going to give you an answer of 35.028 pounds per day. You could probably round that to 35.0. All right, the next question. A water treatment facility is treating 8.25 million gallons per day. If the desired dose for chlorine is 1.8 milligrams per liter, how many pounds of chlorine per day are required? Again, I can start with my known and my unknown. Question gives us our knowns. It's treating 8.25 million gallons per day, and it wants a dosage of 1.8 milligrams per liter. Again, our unknown is in pounds per day. And all our information for the bottom of the Davidson pie chart is available. That means that the feed rate in pounds per day is equal to the dosage milligrams per liter times the flow million gallons per day times the standard of 8.34 pounds per gallon. Plug all that into your equation. Do the math. The answer is 123.8 pounds per day. Question number three, a water treatment facility is treating 5.8 million gallons per day. If the desired dose for chlorine is 1.5 milligrams per liter, how many pounds of chlorine per day are required? Again, start with the known and the unknowns. Taking from our formula what they give us, the flow 5.8 million gallons per day, desired dosage 1.5 milligrams per liter. What we don't know is pounds per day. We're solving for pounds a day again. So the feed rate in pounds per day is equal to the dosage milligrams per liter times the flow million gallons a day times 8.34 pounds per gallon. Plug all those numbers into your formula, and do the math, and we get an answer of 72.558 pounds per day. Question number four, what is the chlorine dosage in milligrams per liter if 4.6 million gallons a day is treated with 55 pounds of chlorine? Again, start with your known and your unknowns. What was given to us this time was the 4.6 million gallons per day and the 55 pounds per day. And what we don't know is the dosage. This is going to be different from the previous problems because you're going to start moving your little pie charts around. So because we're solving for dose, which is on the bottom, Dosage in milligrams per liter equals the feed rate in pounds, which will now be divided by the flow in million gallons a day times 8.34 pounds a gallon. Plug those numbers in. 55 pounds a day divided by 4.6 million gallons a day times 8.34 pounds a gallon. 38.36. 55 divided by 38.36, you're going to get an answer of 1.43 milligrams per liter. Question number five, how many pounds per day of liquid alum are used if the flow rate is 12.7 million gallons a day and the dosage is 8.25 milligrams per liter? Purity of the alum is 48%. Again, we're going to start with our known and our unknown. 
The flow is 12.7 million gallons a day. The dosage is 8.25 milligrams per liter. Purity is at 48%. What are unknown is pounds per day. The Davidson pie chart that we have over here, you can see the pounds per day is chemical feed at 100% purity. So what we're going to do first is solve for pounds per day of 100% purity, and we'll go from there. You plug in uh, your 8.25 milligrams per liter and your 12.7 million gallons a day times 8.34 pounds. You get 873.82 pounds. Again, that's at 100% purity. So to solve now, we're going to divide the 873.82 at 100% by the 48% as a decimal. 873.82 divided by 0.48 is going to give us our answer. The answer is 1,820.4656 pounds. Again, depending on the way the questions are asked, you can either round that to 1,820 or 1,820.5 because the 6 would go up. Make the five four a five. Question number six How many pounds per day of lime are being used to treat 4.5 million gallons a day with a dosage of 7.2 milligrams per liter? The lime is 89% pure. Again, we start with our known and our unknown. 4.5 million gallons a day, 7.2 milligrams per liter, 89% pure. Unknown, the pounds per day. Apes and pie chart solves for 100% purity. We'll do that first. Plug in your 7.2 milligrams per liter times 4.5 million gallons a day times 8.34 pounds a gallon. At 100% purity, we need 270.216 ounce per day. Being that we are 89% pure, we'll divide the 270.216 pounds per day by 0 .9, 0 0.89. 89% is a decimal. And that will leave you with the answer of 303.61 pounds a day. Question number seven. A treatment plant is using 880 pounds a day of chlorine gas. The chlorine demand is 2.8 milligrams per liter and the chlorine residual is 1.5 milligrams per liter. How many million gallons per day are being treated? Again, we're going to start with our known and our unknowns. This one is starting to get a little more complicated and adding some more factors in. Our knowns are our 880 pounds a day of chlorine gas. Our chlorine demand is 2.8 milligrams per liter. And our chlorine residual of 1.5 milligrams per liter. The unknown is the million gallons a day being treated and the total chlorine that's being dosed. So the total chlorine dosage is equal to the chlorine demand plus the chlorine residual, breakpoint chlorination. The talk for another day. If you haven't done that before, you need to look into it. But again, the total chlorine dotus, dosage is the chlorine demand plus the chlorine residual. The 2.8 milligrams per liter plus 1.5 milligrams per liter equals a dosage of 4.3 milligrams per liter. Now we can change our known and our unknowns because we now know the total dosage. 
So our known is 880 pounds a day, 4.3 milligrams per liter, and we're still looking for the flow in million gallons a day. Rearrange your pie chart again. We're solving for million gallons a day. So the pounds per day of chemical feed, 100% purity, we divided by the dosage times the standard of 8.34 pounds per gallon. 880 pounds per day divided by 4.3 milligrams per liter times 8.34 pounds a gallon. The 880 divided by 35.862. It's going to leave you with an answer of 24.538 million gallons a day. We round that to 24.5 MGD. All right, so I'm going to stop here with this Davidson pie chart slash dosage lesson. Um, I'm going to make part two. Stuff gets, starts getting a little more complicated. So this is just a good, quick, basic overview for me. Like I said, it helps me study. Hopefully it helps you. Then I'll probably put out a part two. Thanks.